Who who do we go to next? Let's get the deck from Rice update because that's very important as well. Sky Sports reported this out today as well. Um, but yes, Sky Sports has said Declan Rice are expected to be 90 mil for the West Ham and England midfielder. Um, Declan Rice has made West Ham's captain last summer. Arsenal signed Jorginho and Jeremy, but McCarthy have managed to keep uh, to keen uh, to strengthen his midfield. City and United all have been linked with, it, with Rice as well. Darmish, big up to Darmish as well. <laughs> um, yeah, th this could be pretty reliable to be fair. All right, let's get into this, guys. Arsenal expects to make a formal bid worth 90 million for West Ham captain Declan Rice. The Gunners have had the opening. 80 mil offer uh, plus add-ons, which would have uh, paid in so slow installments with a lot of tough continuances. That's with rejected by West Ham, who are holding out for 120 mil, uh, 120 mil, as we know. It is understood that the Hammers would accept 100 mil plus a player, though. Plus a player, that's interesting. Man City, Man United, also interested in 24-year-old. Rice who replaced Mark Noble's skipper before the start of the last, uh, this season, for he's a type of fresh player with the East London sides. Gunners have made bits of Brighton, Moise Caetano in January. Chance window and only ended up signing Jorginho from London rivals Chelsea. But Arteta, who mostly relied on Thomas Partey, Granit Xhaka and Martin Odegaard as his midfielders last season, remains to strengthen in that area of the field. Um, is that it? Yeah, so apparently we're putting a second bid worth 90 mil plus add-ons, which will make it 100 mil. Will it be accepted, guys? Do you think it's going to be accepted? Will the second bid be accepted? Oh, it's hard to say, man. It's hard to say. Um, look, 90 mil plus add-ons, is, is that going to be enough for them? Is that going to be enough? Let me just check, because someone said, I think Fabrizio, did Fabrizio give us a tweet as well about it? Did, did Fabrizio tweet it out as well? Let's have a look. Did Fabrizio tweet it as well? Yes, he did, guys. Fabrizio has indeed tweeted it. So let me share Fabrizio's tweet, because he is a GOAT. Give respect to where, uh, give respect where respect is due, and let's do this. So yeah, Fabrizio has indeed tweeted this. There we go, guys. Fabrizio has tweeted it. So yeah, also second bid for uh, for Declan and Rice will be submitted in the next hours. Uh, it, will, it was never sent last week, as Arsenal will remain calm, fearing that the players want the move. Second proposal will be around 90 million, not linked to the Roman Lavia deal. No bid yet in that case. So that's we'll talk about Lavia in a minute. But yeah, so guys, official Fabrizio has confirmed it. Arsenal are going to put in our second bid in the next few hours 90 million plus add ons to make it to 100 million, guys. Now we wait. Next hours, guys. So tonight there should be another stream, hopefully. Either West Ham have accepted Declan Rice's uh, Arsenal's proposal. Or they've even rejected Arsenal's pro pro uh, proposal. Please accept it, West Ham. Do I think it'd be accepted? I don't think it will. I hate to be negative. I don't think it will. I feel like they're, they're going to want a bit more. Um, I reckon it's going to have to be 100 mil plus add ons, in my opinion. So it may be about. Oh, but then, come on, 100 mil for Declan Rice is taking a piss, West Ham. They're taking the mick in it. Ain't no way. Like, I know English tax and all that stuff, but it ain't no way he's worth. Or oh, he's valued that. 120 mil, by the way. Come on, man. I just got a feeling, I don't know what it is. I feel like they're going to, you know, reject the second bids. And then we have to go for 100 mil plus a few more add-ons, I reckon. But yeah, look. Second bid in the next couple of hours, guys. So that means stay tuned tonight because we're going to find out if it got either accepted or rejected. So hopefully it gets rejected and then, you know, we sign Declan Rice pretty much, isn't it? It's, it, it's that simple, but there's, a, there's no news about, you know, it's interesting that Fabrizio hasn't mentioned about, or Sky or any of, any of the journalists haven't mentioned about Man City. Because we know uh, Man City wanted the player as well. You know, we know Man City uh, wanted Declan Rice when, when they were hovering around the deal. Um, so maybe they're waiting for Arsenal. Maybe if this one gets rejected, then they'll come in for their own bids. Um but it's interesting because I, I I don't think they're going to get... I, I reckon they want Kovacic instead, don't they? So, Or maybe they'll do the buyback for uh, uh, Romeo Lavia. But yeah, look, Declan Rice, guys, uh, as I said a few weeks ago, I'm confident it's going to get done. 
You know, I was 95% confident last week. I am still pretty similar uh, to that confident level this week. I think it is going to get done. I think uh, it's going to be a great signing. 100 mils of piss take, I can't lie. But end of the day, we pay the money, Arsenal. Get this player into our club. You know, we've lost out on Caicedo. 